Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, family. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Mental House with me, your host, Khadija. I want to welcome all my Facebook listeners um, and my listeners all across the diaspora. Thank you for being here. And I'm glad that there's just a little something uh, in this mental house that you can relate to. And I'm happy to have you, especially those of y'all in Cambodia. Let me give you a shout out. Thank you so much. Um, what I wanted to do today is because I have a cousin that asked me what is a relation, a healthy relationship. What does it what does it look like if I could give you a visual of a healthy relationship between a parent and a child uh, because the job doesn't come with a manual and how would that um, look like to me what what would it, how would I illustrate that well I thought of none other than my good uh, sister from another mother sister Rita Lisa I'm sorry Morano and uh Lisa has what she illustrated was the aesthetics of a healthy child-parent relationship and an unhealthy child-parent relationship. So I want to attempt to show you that visual right now. Y'all got to kind of excuse my writing. Or my drawing because you know it's not the best. But as I do this, I want you to focus on the eye contact, the validation, the reassurance from the parent to the child that's saying, Hey, it's cool, everything is good. You all right, I love you just how you are. Yeah, you got a little uh some kind of way of expressing yourself and guess what that's who you are and I accept you just how you are um, that looks a certain way when you are enough and just who you are is good enough that looks a certain way so this picture in my opinion illustrates what a healthy relate parent child relationship is and here we go as you can see the little child is looking at the mommy lovingly and just full of love because the baby's heart is always so full of love for the caregiver the parent uh, and it's looking to learn is looking to be validated and is looking to uh, this source to reflect back what's coming out of this little heart. And all I see is little love, little hearts coming out of this little heart to the big heart. And then if you look at mommy, mommy is reciprocating. She's giving the child eye contact. She's looking at that baby. And she's like, hey, baby, you straight. Everything is good. What do you need? I'm here for you. Your needs are very important to me. And I honor you. I welcome you to this thing called life. You are not a burden to me. You are a beautiful, independent creation of God. A reflection of the creator. And in you, I see love, and I want to honor that love. That's what the healthy mama reflects back to her child. Y'all see that? That's what it looked like, cuz. That's what it looked like. All right. So, when you figure, okay, well, I guess that's cool. Well, well. What's the what's the point here? Well, the point here is the relationship that you may have with a parent 
that is not reflecting all of those things that is um, being absent, being too smothering, being um, dishonoring of the child, being unattentive to the child, unvalidating, then you have a circumstance or an illustration that looks like this. You see the little baby? He's trying to give his mother love. He's like, Mommy, see me? See me, Mama? Hey, Ma. And Mama has got her hands crossed in a, a guarded position. And she's not really interested in anything that the baby really is talking about. The baby is just here. She's probably thinking about her date tonight with uh, Johnny May or whatever. She's thinking about her uh, appointment at the uh, health spa or the <laughs> or the manicures or the pedicures. Whatever she's thinking about, it is totally not reciprocating of the young hearts and the love that is being dished out by this little baby. Can y'all see that? And the ramifications behind that kind of love from your primary caregiver is extremely, extremely devastating because it has nowhere to go it's it's not reciprocated it's not acknowledged it's just nothing and you got to figure out what to do with all these emotions and you got to figure out how to bend and twist and make this person either notice you or You know, not forget that you're alive <laughs> emotionally. Because it just doesn't seem like this parent is too interested in whatever love bug that this baby is trying to send to the mommy. So, very quick illustration of what I call looking at it from a visual perspective of an unhealthy child mom give and take relationship and a healthy loving eye to eye contact validation that acceptance of the child and these two things can determine a lot about whether the child gets the most out of his or her life. A lot of times it just illustrates to you and I how difficult it must be when your love is not reciprocated, especially by your primary caregiver. So, now you see that now you got something to think about all right thanks a lot for being out there like i said i was gonna do that real quick and uh hope to see you next time right here in the mental house Bye -bye. hey leave a comment below tell me what you think please and also hit the little button so if i do another video you can be reminded like what you hear please subscribe please share 